everyone welcome to my channel today I'm headed outside Boise to Nampa to get some fresh picked sweet corn and we'll just drive along the freeway here and I'll point out a few things as we go up on the right hand side is the Lactalis uh, Cheese Factory. Years ago it was known as Swiss Village Cheese Factory. They had squeaky cheese. It was a great little place to stop in and get a snack. I believe the shop has reopened so you might be able to get some more of that squeaky cheese. Also on the right hand side here is the Amazon Distribution Center, this gigantic building houses um, all sorts of Amazon products and it's really strange. We've actually been able to have a few of our Amazon orders delivered overnight. It's really weird to wake up in the morning and have a package on your front door. So um, yeah, they've expanded here into the Nampa area. Also on the right hand side here, we've got a bunch of car dealerships. So. It's kind of fun to look over and see what new cars they have. large building that you see up ahead is the Amalgamated Sugar Company. Here in Idaho, there's actually three factories that are still uh, in operation. There's this one here in Nampa, one in Twin Falls, and one in Paul. Uh, combined, they produce a total of up to 2.2 billion pounds of sugar per year. And that is sugar that is produced from sugar beets. our destination here on the left we are pulling into Simpsons sweet corn Monday through Saturday, 10 a.m. until they sell out. As you can see by the sign here, it is $6 per dozen, $15 for three dozen of corn, and it is cash only. I will go ahead and link their Facebook page in the description of this video. going to show you how I like to cook this corn up. For 
first things first, we gotta preheat our oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit or 204 Celsius. Right, uh, to start with, uh, Jubilee's watching what we're doing here. You can see her in the upper right hand corner. But I'm gonna go ahead and get the corn washed. Just get all that uh, good farm dirt off and then I'm gonna take off the some of the outside husk. Just kind of thin it down a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and cut that long silk off the end. Just get that trimmed up a bit. Next I'm going to go ahead and just try and flush as much water into the corn husk as I can. I'm going to break that end off there and just really, really get the corn nice and wet. All right, and I've got all my corn ready, so now it's time to go to the oven. So I'm going to place each ear of corn directly on the rack inside the oven. And I'm going to time it for 45 minutes to one hour. There's a blast of steam. Oh, it smells so good. Just, oh, that roasted corn smell. Got my brick of butter. Let me go ahead and finish getting this husk off and the silk just comes right off so easy. Break this off here, and youch, that hurt. It was just a little hot there. All right, we are going to load this corn up with tons of butter. a sprinkle of salt and maybe some pepper. Now it's time to enjoy. It's really good guys. This is the best way to make corn. Thumbs up!